Hi, Jerry Neiser here for Real Green Pest and Lawn Care. Let's talk for a second about grub worms. Grub worms are a really common problem throughout the whole United States. Um, there's a lot of different products for treatment. Let's talk first about how, how to identify if you do have grub worms. Grub worms are an uh, insect that um, has, a, has a multiple life cycles. In other words, in most areas you're going to have at least two generations you could have up to four. In, in the southern United States, in Austin, Texas, we generally have one to two generations. Grub worms are the larva of the June bug. June bugs are nocturnal. They favor high ambient light sources. So, if you have a street light or you happen to keep your lights on at night, you will attract the, uh, the June bugs. June bugs, however, do not like poor soil conditions. They do not like compacted soils. They don't like unhealthy soils. So, if you're working on your lawn and you've created, you've, you've done what you're supposed to do and you've got a nice loose soil full of organic life um, and you happen to have a high ambient light source from a street light or maybe you keep your front porch light on, you're probably going to end up with grub worms. Grub worms, different times of the year, different timing. Now we're going to talk about Central Texas since that's where we are. The grub worms, the, uh, the actual June bug, bug rather, they fly somewhere in uh, the early to mid part of May. Okay, when, they, when you see the first flight of the June bug, that is proper treatment time. And the reason for that is, is that the product that's used, imidacloprid, brand name Merit, takes a while for it to translocate through the plant. And what I mean for that is that it takes for a while for it to be absorbed into the grass blade or, the, or, or whatever the plant is and it takes a while for it to move. General rule of thumb is the longer it takes for it to, to be absorbed into the plant, the longer it will last. A metacloprid is a uh, product that's found actually in some of the flea products that you use on your pets. Uh, Advantix, for instance, the basis there is a metacloprid. A metacloprid is um, very reliable. It's been on the market for years. It uh, is put on the, on the lawn in May to last through the end of the summer in general and uh, it translocates to the plant. So what happens is the, the uh, June bugs will fly for a few weeks. They'll drop and they'll lay their eggs in that same area that they were living in, you know, underneath that street light or by your driveway lights or front porch light. They'll lay their eggs and immediately those eggs will hatch into uh, the grubs. The grub worms feed voraciously, voraciously, or whatever the word is, for several months. They'll, uh, they'll take in 200 times their body weight and they'll, they'll, they'll grow like crazy. What they're doing when they're moving through the soil is they're feeding on organic matter. The grass roots just happen to be in the way and so that's what they, you know, that, so they, they actually devour the, the roots of the plant and that of course keeps the plant, the grass itself, from pulling in moisture and what, and what you'll see that first year because the roots are gone is when you try, if you get on your hands and knees, the grass will actually feel spongy. If you're walking across the grass, it'll, it'll feel spongy. And so if you were to grab the grass with both hands and, and give it a, a pull, it'll actually lift like uh, shag carpet because there's nothing attached. The, uh, the stolons go for long distance, so it'll pull moisture in from different parts of the lawn and feed itself, so it'll, it'll just lift like this, but actually that first year, that what we're, um, you generally won't see any dieback. Most of the dieback comes in the second year, so that first year, what you'll see is it'll lift like shag carpet. The grass itself will have a puffy appearance if you look at it from the street. When you walk across it, it'll feel abnormally soft, and when you mow across it, it'll feel, you'll actually feel a bit more resistance than normal. Okay, but the main thing to know is it just lifts like shag carpet in the second year is when the damage occurs. And the reason for that is, like most plants, the grass itself stores carbohydrates in the fall. These carbohydrates produced through photosynthesis are used in the springtime to transition from dormancy into growing grass again. What happens is those carbohydrates aren't available because the roots weren't there in the fall. And so what you'll see is the grass will start to transition from dormancy and become green, but it'll fall on its face and all of a sudden your lawn is dead. <laughs> so 
you'll end up not, you know, generally with splotchy dead areas throughout the yard, and that's grub worm damage for you. So let's recap on that, the, on uh, grub worm damage. Grub worm damage starts um, midsummer. Generally, the first flight of the June bug in central Texas is in May. That is the time that you treat with a metacloprid's preferred product. Um, look on, you know, when you're at the Home Depot or whatever big box store you happen to be in, look at the ingredients. Don't buy by brand, buy by ingredient. Look for a metacloprid. Apply that product in May. It'll last through probably the first part of September. It'll make the grass actually toxic to these insects and only these insects. It, uh, it's not toxic to uh, your people or, or, or pets. Common ingredient actually found in Advantix for fleas. It's put directly on pets. Um, into the first year, lift like shag carpet. Only occurs in healthy soil. And that second year is when the grass will actually fall on its face when it tries to transition from dormancy to actively growing. I'm Jerry Neiser for Real Green Pest and Lawn Care. Check out our other videos. Check out our website online. You'll find much more information on this and other topics. RealGreenLawns.com. If you need help diagnosing this problem or any other problem and you're in our market area, give us a call at 45Green 454-7336. We'll send somebody out at no, no charge to you to take a look. Have a great day.